Welcome to the Hour of Code in Tustin Unified. In this video, you will learn how to code using the app Daisy the Dinosaur. To begin, click on the icon you see on the screen. There are two ways to play with this app. The first is the free play mode. This lets you code whatever you want. We'll come back to this. The challenge mode provides a series of challenges to help teach you how to code with Daisy the Dinosaur. Let me read the challenge for you. It says, hello and welcome to Hopscotch. Try figuring out how to move Daisy so that she stops in the center of the star. So the first thing you're going to do is take the move forward block of code and drag it into your workspace. Go ahead and click play to run the code and we did it. Congratulations, you completed the challenge. Let's move on to the next challenge. It says reach for the clouds. Now the circle is a little higher. Use the jump method to reach it. So first I'm gonna pull over my move forward block of code and then the jump code. Perfect, Daisy reached the star. You have completed the challenge. You are an amazing coder. Let's try the next one. It says make Daisy dizzy. Make Daisy spin five times. So now I will pull five spin blocks of code into the workspace. When I run my code, Daisy spins five times. Congratulations, you did it. You completed the next challenge. Let's move on to the next one. This one is called loop-de-loop. -loop. Try making Daisy spin five times while only using the spin method once. Here's a hint. Put the spin inside of the repeat five block of code. You can see now that the spin code will repeat five times. Perfect, we completed the challenge. You are an amazing coder. The next challenge is called Control Daisy Yourself. Here's something new, the when block of code. The when block of code gives you a method for moving Daisy. It can be touch or shake. Go ahead and change it to touch. Now we're gonna put the move block of code inside the when method. And then when we hit play, you touch Daisy and each time you touch Daisy, Daisy will move forward. So keep touching Daisy until Daisy gets to the star. You are moving Daisy yourself. Congratulations, you completed the challenge. Congratulations, you completed all of the challenges. You are an amazing coder. You get to go to the free play mode. In the free play mode, you can use a variety of commands to make Daisy grow, shrink, jump, roll, spin, anything you want. My suggestion is create a dance party. Play some music and have Daisy dance to your music. Look at the code I use to have Daisy dance to the music. All right, coders, you're doing great. Keep it up. Enjoy the hour of code.